board games are continuing to make a comeback, and I'm here inside of Grand Ledge's newest game lounge that's bringing the fun to Bridge Street. Earlier in the week, we met the local board gaming community. Now, we're introducing you to Homebrew Tabletop Gaming Lounge. Two years ago, we had this wild idea that we wanted to create a game lounge. Um, so, we've been going and doing that ever since. Yeah. The board game industry has it's grown 15 to 20 percent every year um, in the U.S. alone, let alone as a global market. So what better time than now to collect a variety of games and bring them all to the lounge? We've been very fortunate. We've been able to, through estate sales and other large purchases, get a lot of the games that we've gotten. Um, but part of that is because the industry as a whole, there are so many more collectors of board games. To Jeff and Sedona, these days, games are much more than just games. Reading skills, math skills, leadership skills, cooperation skills. These games, some of these games are cooperative, some of them are competitive, some can be both. And the list goes on. We're also busy being plugged in. We're also busy, you know, rushing around between work and home. And now we have a chance to just sit down and find a third place that you can just be yourself, relax. And like I said, meet new people or you just meet up with old friends. Jeff and Sedona's hope for homebrew is to bring back the sense of community bonding through lighthearted fun. Homebrew will be officially open for business later next week, and they hope to see community members of all ages come together and play. Here in Grand Ledge, I'm your neighborhood reporter, Asia Lawrence, Fox 47 News.